What's up, gamers? Uh, this is Barnes, and uh, this is just a video about uh, me sharing the environment in which I live in. Uh, for you that don't know, I live in a commercial space here in Soares, New York, that's attached to an antique store that I uh, work with and do business with all the time. And I kind of watch out for the business of kind of like the super of the building. Um, <clears throat> and I have access to pretty much the whole building. It's one of the biggest buildings in Sorgates. It's the oldest wooden building um, in Sorgates. And Sorgates was part of Kingston, New York at um, one time, uh, the state's first capital. Um, part of that reason was is it was underdeveloped. It wasn't as big as Kingston. So they just, you know, it wasn't until later on to Sorgates. The 1811 to Sorgates got big enough to be its own. Uh, spot, but some interesting notes about Sorgates is that the Articles of Association were signed here and they originally signed at Colby's Tavern, but it didn't provide enough space, so they came around the corner to this building and signed it here. So, one of the first ideas of the United States was signed in this building. Um, and most of the building, it was a block long, most of it had burnt down. Uh, it was Victorian, like the era type deal. And this is the remaining section, which is uh, known as Central Antiques Hotel. Um, it was a hotel for a very big hotel back in the day and so we're just going to try to go around and show you some of the some of the place where i live here now, this is the bottom floor i can't show you the whole building just because it's too much of a pain in the ass and uh there's ghosts here no doubt and uh, i'm just going to uh try to give you a quick look of the the major walkways through here i i, I can't go through every nook and cranny of the building um but you'll see some antiques in the back, whatever, some weird stuff, just in general. There's an old fire, uh, wood stove here. Um, you know, and one thing about living in an antique store, there's a lot of great props everywhere. Um, it's kind of hard to get this on with my laptop, but we'll try to show you some of this stuff, I guess. There's nothing really great in the store right now. Most stuff kind of, anything really good goes really fast. Um, I was mentioning to, uh, and or that, you know, last month we had a book signed by uh, the Princess Anastasia. And uh, that was a really cool piece of history. It was the last known signature of hers. And it was bought up by a collector in Chicago. And I was hoping that they would send me out there to uh, deliver, but they didn't. Because I'd go harass Brady, but uh, they didn't send me out there. So I'm trying to get you a feel. I can't really get the whole place in here, even... All the lights are out now. They just closed for the holiday. Old saws in the background and stuff. Um, but as we walk through the building, you'll start to recognize some more areas that uh, you're more familiar with of me. I, I've gotten some of the layouts of some of your like some of your places that you guys actually live. I'm starting to get the load and layout of hammers and um, Robert J. Fremantles just by them posting the videos. So I kind of figured I'd just show my unusual living conditions and uh, I, I could have turned the lights on and all these but I couldn't find them at the moment and this is uh the facade here let's see that side there Miss Lucy's five rated Sorgates is a kind of odd town um yeah now we're gonna go up uh up the stairs here if anyone wants to buy any of this stuff just say hey, let me know <laughs> we'll work out a deal and uh, this is the stair of mirrors. This is where all the mirrors are. And we'll, I'm not sure how much of this upper floor I'm really going to be able to show you because some of it is kind of effed up. <laughs> but well, here we go. Here we go. All right, we got more furniture here. Um, we'll try to get you to the balcony, which is pretty cool. Some revolutionary stuff. A lot of records floating around. <laughs> More records floating around. Chairs, books, old fans. I think that's an old heating unit. Uh, I'm trying to get that in frame, is it? You see that? That's an old heating unit. They're completely illegal today. But that's what they looked like back in the day. <laughs> And we got some old radios over here, uh, comic books. Um, yeah, ma. I'm doing a video. Hold on. Uh, hold on a second. My mom's here. I'm in the antique store. I'm in the antique store. 
I'll be there in a second. All right, it's downstairs. On, underneath the stairs. Yeah. No. That's mom. Mom showed up for a visit. Now we'll do some gift exchange. Down the stairs and then underneath them. Some more books there. Maybe you'll see my mom in the background. Uh, here's like the clothing section. Over here. What? Are you there with someone? No, I'm doing a video for YouTube. Oh. I'm just showing people where I live. Because I live in an unusual situation. Would you agree? We're going to go back over the other side. Only we'll by the clothing. This whole area is kind of dark. I don't, I'm not going to really be able to show you this, but I'll try to get it in here. I don't think you guys are going to be really able to see this corner. Oh well. There's some interesting stuff over there. And there's just more antique stuff here. Um, I don't know if you're going to be able to see, but see where that light's coming through? That's where storage is for me. Those rooms are kind of messed up. I store a lot of stuff in there. Um, it's actually like an encased porch. It's actually three rooms back there, but uh, I'm not going to get really get into that. Back over to the clothing section here. Again, if you guys see anything, you know, just let me know and maybe we'll come to a deal. Work a price out. I'm sure half of you I've lost already because this is boring as hell. But uh, for the reasons I didn't, thanks for watching. And uh, I mean, it has its advantages living here. I know. So, we'll see. I'm just going through the uh, aisles of clothes right now. I'm not even going to go bother going around. I'll just try to straight around the corner more. Some more junk. Alright, here we go. And yeah, pretty soon you guys are going to start to recognize some stuff. Um, whoa. Boxes of antique G.I. Joe's here I picked up recently. They're not really worth that much. Cool old crush can. Never been opened. And so now you guys should start to recognize some stuff. As we're back into the gaming room. And uh, this is where I do most of my videos. As you guys can see. And this is pretty much the room. That's the gaming table. Right there. Yeah, we'll walk out. This is the room I don't use too much. Got a little mini fridge, you know. Uh, microwave. Um, you know, some stuff over here. Some models, some paints. Random crap books. Comic books. Games. Uh, miniatures. Models. More games. This mom. You guys want to meet my mom? Come here, Ma. This is my mom. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Ma. I love you. Merry Christmas. Well, I'll be right back, Ma. I'm going to show them the rest of the place. I'm almost done. There's a door that goes into the antique shop that I have uh, closed off. There. And now we're outside and back. And we're on the back porch. We're on the back porch. And we're going up. And we're going to go up to the third floor. And uh, this is where I rent a bathroom <laughs> from the neighbors here. Uh, Dave and Brian and Molly. Hello. Hey, what's up, man? We're doing a video tour. This is like the walkway up here. Dave's not here. Brian, you want to say hi? Ryan doesn't want to say hi to you. He hates you. <laughs> He's painting right now. He's a painter. This is the kitchen coming in here. We'll give you a view out here if we can. It's nailed down. I can't. All right. I didn't know. I never knew that was nailed down. And here's the yellow room. It's pretty empty at the moment. This is a painting by one of my players. Plays in my group. Norton. We have some artists in the group. Mostly artists and scientists. I don't know what's up with that. Uh oh. I'm losing power. And this is the bathroom I rent. 
That's pretty key for me to rent a bathroom since I don't have one. And this is where I do the shower and stuff. Right there. Hey guys. Back to the window. All right, and uh, it's pretty much the whole tour. Behind this red door is uh, some extra rooms that we're going to try to utilize next year. And we're going to go back downstairs. And we'll see Mom. And uh, then we'll sign off. This is the porch area here. I don't know if you guys can see this, really. It's an old-ass building, though. Some view of the rooftops around here. Pretty cool. Old schoolhouse back there. I don't know if you can be able to see that. It's now my own family of Woodstock. They're a charity organization. So we're coming back down the stairs. And a uh, little deck area right here. And there's another flight of stairs. The garbage is right at the bottom of the door. Some old canvas I gotta put to use somehow. Anyway, uh, hope you guys have a good holiday. And uh, that was the tour of my living conditions. And uh, I'll be doing another video soon. And uh, we'll miss you guys. And we'll talk to you soon. And uh, say happy holidays, man. Happy, happy holidays. holidays. Bye, guys.